Hello, my name is Ali Mehdi and in this video I'm going to talk to you about value added tax or more commonly known as VAT. As you might be aware that VAT is going to be implemented in the UAE as a matter of fact in the entire GCC and for that purpose it is essential that you have knowledge of what VAT is, how it operates and also how it is going to affect you. Uh, well, the first thing to understand over here is that VAT affects every step of the supply chain. Um, in order to um, explain this further, I'd give the example of a coffee shop. In this picture, you can see the coffee shop, the bean seller and the customer. You can also see Federal Tax Authority. This is a new organization in the UAE and the purpose of this organization is to deal with tax related matters such as the VAT. Now, as you can see in the picture, the coffee shop receives 200 dirhams plus 10 dirhams VAT from the customer. This 10 dirhams is the output tax. The coffee shop also pays 100 dirhams to the bean seller plus 5 dirhams VAT. This 5 dirhams is the input tax. Now, the coffee shop will subtract the input tax from the output tax, which means that they will pay only 5 dirhams to the Federal Tax Authority. The bean seller, since the bean seller does not have any input tax in this example, will pay the tax it received, the uh, 5 dirhams, to the Federal Tax Authority. You can see that the Federal Tax Authority receives a total of 10 dirhams, 5 dirhams from the coffee shop and 5 dirhams from the bean seller. In this example, you can see how the entire supply chain is affected by what? Now, the next question is, what can you do about VAT as an organization or as an individual working for an organization? The first thing is to train yourself. Either hire a trainer or an expert to guide you through the entire VAT process. For that purpose, if you want any training or if there is any way in which I can help you, you can contact me at the contact number and the email address which I would provide you at the end of this video.